Hello everybody, my name is Ataku Barry. You are you and this is Dragon Age Inquisition Volume 2. And can I just say before we that is a majestic sight. Look at that beautiful, beautiful sight. I mean, I don't know about you, but that is an amazing mustache. Glorious. Also, we are in Haven in the Frostback Mountains. I suppose I should do a what happened recently, so to recap we awoke and found out we had a mark on our hand that had the ability to close the rifts that had appeared across the skies, which were letting out demons upon the world. Also, we found out that several people on the higher-ups of each of the designated factions were now dead. Uh, apparently, it's my character's fault that this is, you know, this has happened. Uh, personally, don't think it is, but hey... Apparently, my guy's really powerful. Um, anywho, we, also, we were able to close some and now we are in Haven, regarded as the Herald of Andraste, sent merely as a messenger, or a way of God, to cure it. Without further ado, let's go to the War Room and probably going to quiet down a little here and let the plot take over. Okay. Also, we got a sweet-ass kill. Should probably mention that. Does it trouble you? If it wasn't enough to close the breach, what use is it? You did everything we asked of you. And it still didn't work. What's important is that your mark is now stable, as is the breach. You've given us time, and Solas believes a second attempt might succeed provided the mark has more power. The same level of power used to open the breach in the first place. That is not easy to come by. What harm could there be in powering up something we barely understand? Hold on to that sense of humor. Did I make her smile? Ooh. It's almost the apocalypse. May I present Commander Cullen, leader of the Inquisition's forces. Such as they are, we lost many soldiers in the valley, and I fear many more before this is through. This is Lady Josephine Montelier, our ambassador and chief diplomat. I've heard much. It's a pleasure to meet you at last. And of course, you know Sister Leliana. My position here involves a degree. She is our ambassador. Yes, tactfully put, Cassandra. Impressive titles. But none of you are heroes of Andraste. I mentioned that your mark needs more power or to close the breach for good. Which means we must approach the rebel mages for help. And I still disagree. The Templars could serve just as well. We need power, Commander. Enough magic poured into that mark. Might destroy us all. Templars could suppress the breach, weaken it, so... Pure speculation. I was a Templar. I know what they're capable of. Unfortunately, neither group will even speak to us. He has denounced the Inquisition. Specifically. Eh. Didn't take long. take long. Shouldn't they be wow. arguing over who's going to become divine? Some are calling you, a mage, the Herald of Andraste. That frightens the Chantry. The remaining clerics have declared it blasphemy. And we, heretics, for harboring you. Chancellor Roderick's doing, no doubt. It limits our options. Approaching the Majors or Templars for help is currently out of the question. They aren't more concerned about the breach, the real threat. They do know it's a threat, they just don't think we can stop it. The Chantry is telling everyone you'll make it worse. There is something you can do. A Chantry cleric by the name of Mother Giselle has asked to speak to you. She is not far and knows those involved far better than I. Her assistance could be invaluable. Sure, let's team up with the Chantry. What could possibly go wrong? You will find Mother Giselle tending to the wounded in the hinterlands near Redcliffe. Look for other opportunities to expand the Inquisition's influence while you're there. 
We need agents to extend our reach beyond this valley, and you're better suited than anyone to recruit them. In the meantime, let's think of other options. I won't leave this all to the Herald. You're damn right, you're coming with me. Welcome to the war table. Ole a Ferelden. Well, I've always been a fan of Ferelden, so we're going to Ferelden. And our first mission is to find Mother Giselle. That went well. And I'm guessing that's Mother Giselle. Okay, we avoided the fighting as best we could. It's every bit as bad as we'd feared. The apostates are mad, attacking anything that moves. And it appears that the Templars here aren't following anyone any longer. And are trying to protect her, but she refuses to leave the refugees until we've ensured their safety. That will be hard to do without troops to push the apostates and the Templars out of the area. Commander Cullen asked me to make inquiries of Master Dennett, a retired horse master of Redcliffe, who lives in the area. We tried to contact him about obtaining better horses for our Inquisition, but we've been able to get through the fighting. Okay. Well, time to take some people. Finally, we'll get into a bit of open world in this game, and I can begin harvesting for materials. That's a fair point, viewers. I did not consider this before, but there's going to be a lot of grinding going on in this game. So I'm wondering, should I do the grinding as part of the long play and carry on all the way through it? Or should I cut the grinding out and then put it as a separate video for those who wish to view it? Let me know what you think, because I'll be honest, I'm not too sure. I mean, I will leave the grind again just as the main series, you know, n normally. But if you wish, I can break it out at a later stage. Herald of Andraste. Also, you this is General point. Harding. Everyone has. We know what you did at the breach. She's tiny. Everyone's a little nervous around mages right now, but you'll get no back talk here. That's a promise. Inquisition Scout Harding at your service. Pleasure. I, well, all of us here. We'll do whatever we can to help. Harding, huh? Ever been to Kirkwall's High Town? I can't say I have. Why? You'd be Harding and No, <laughs> never mind. Uh. <laughs> it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should get to business. The situation's pretty dire. We came to secure horses from Redcliffe's old horsemen. I grew up here, and people always said and its herds were the strongest and the fastest this side of the Frostbacks. But with the Mage Templar fighting getting worse, we couldn't get to Dennett. Maker only knows if he's even still alive. Mother Giselle's at the crossroads helping refugees and the wounded. Our latest reports say that the war's spread there, too. Corporal Bale and our men are doing what they can to help protect the people, but... They won't be able to hold out very long. You best get going. No time yes, we've got a lot of grinding to do. So fight people. Ain't that right, Varric? Also, now might be a good time to level up. So, I'm thinking the first thing I need to buy is... I want frost. I want fade step if I'm gonna have anything. Oh, that's better. Do 
do do do do do walking down the hill this game could do with some music oh well bring it on ram This looks like it'll be a good way to train. Dead. Ram letter. <gasps> oh, it's a fennec. Where'd it go? Oh, you're adorable. I'm so sorry. If we team up, we can take them. The apostates have fled to the hills. Right. Elsewhere. Do do do. I need to go. Oh, there's something over here. Interesting. <laughs> Running through the trees. A letter in an empty house. Preface, I know you escaped with the other mages and I know you'll come here. Father told you that if you ever strayed, he'd put you down himself. If you're here, you know he's dead. But I'm not. I'll be killing apostates and waiting for you at Old Phoenix Place to the north. I've got Father Sword and my true brothers and the Templars. Come if you're man enough. Interesting reading. Could be worth a look. Yep, I'm thinking the same, Varric. An aggressive bow? Not as aggressive as Bianca. Right, so down. Ooh, Elfert. Gathering resources. Parkour. I just thought everybody else has to level up. Right, um, yeah, that'll do. Inquisition forces. They're trying to protect the refugees. Looks like they could use a hand. 
Well, technically Solus is an apostate and I'm an apostate. I think the surge Oh, more enemies. Where is Cassandra? Oh, fucker. Here we go. We are not Templars. We mean you no harm. Doesn't look like they're listening. Get ready. Shit. Mm. That's better. Our way. Okay. Why does it hit me so many times? Victorious once more. Yes, yes, we are. Was a nice random stare off. Is here who can heal your wounds. Lie still. Don't. Don't touch me, mother. Their magic is. Turn to noble purpose. Their magic is surely no more evil than your blade. What? Hush, dear boy. Allow them to ease your suffering. Mother Giselle? I am. And you must be the one they are calling the Herald of Andraste. What you said to that soldier? We do not teach that magic is evil. We teach that pride is evil and does not corrupt only mages. But I did not ask you to come simply to debate with me. Then why am I here? Plot. I know of the Chantry's denouncement, and I am familiar with those behind it. I won't lie to you. Some of them are grandstanding, hoping to increase their chances of becoming the new divine. Some are simply terrified. So many good people, senselessly taken from us. What happened was horrible. Fear makes us desperate. But hopefully not beyond reason. Go to them. 
Convince the remaining clerics you are no demon to be feared. They have heard only frightful tales of you. Give them something else to believe. Do you want me to appeal to them? If I thought you were incapable, I wouldn't suggest it. Will they even listen? Let me put it this way. You needn't convince them all. You just need some of them to doubt. The power is the unified voice. Take that from them and you receive the time you need. So I show up, say hello, show them the mark on my hand. I honestly don't know if you've been touched by fate or sent to help us, but I hope. Hope is what we need now. The people will listen to your rallying call as they will listen to no other. You could build the Inquisition into a force that will deliver us or destroy us. I will go to Haven and provide Sister Leliana the names of those in the Chantry who will be amenable to a gathering. It is not much, but I will do whatever I can. <sighs> okay. <gasps> Shops at last. What do you have? Shite. More shite. An arrow on the end of a stick. That looks a little better. Eh, uh, what have I actually got? Maybe I can sell shit. Oh yeah, I've got loads of stuff. Um, do I need this? I probably do. Do you sell scrolls, perhaps? Oh, what? Wait a minute, you sold materials, didn't you? Ram leather. I don't really have a lot in the way of money, so... I think for now I should leave their stores. No. Cool. Let's return back to Haven. I think I need to check a few things there. Still have a lot to do here, but I think there's more important things. Back at Haven. Do 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 waiting for the loading screen takes far too long. Oh come on game. Hope they've got some new armor here. And we're back. And everybody's working hard. And here's Cassandra. I think you need practice dummies made of sturdier stuff. That would be nice. Like maybe iron. Did I do the right thing? <laughs> what I have set in motion here could destroy everything I have revered my whole life. One day they may write about me as a traitor, a madwoman, a 
fool, and they may be right. You didn't have any choice. Didn't I? My train is always set. Cassandra, you are too brash. You must think before you act. I see what must be done, and I do it. I see no point in running around in circles like a dog chasing its tail. But I misjudged you in the beginning, did I not? I thought the answer was before me, clear as day. I cannot afford to be so careless again. Can't say I'm not grateful to hear that. Fuck you. I can be harsh, I know. I'm curious. Do you even believe in the Maker? Nope. <laughs> no, I don't. It must be comforting to be so certain. I have to believe we were put on this path for a reason, even if you do not. Now it simply remains to see where it leads us. Want to talk again, or is that us? I actually know much about you. What do you want to know? I'm not sure. Where are you from? The Circle of Magi at Ostwick, at least until the rebellion began. Yes, I suppose that would have required you to stay on the move. Tell me, do you consider the free march as your home? Are you eager to go back? Wherever I am is home enough for me. That's how I feel now, after years of tending to business for the Divine. Oh, I'm glad you feel that way. As you wish. Let's go find the rest of the people and chat to them too, eh? Or perhaps we could go find the shops he came here for in the first place. Ooh, plants. Got quite a few things I need to do. I need to level up, get better gear, train up the recruits. Yeah, I'm going to be here for a while. Game only now telling me how to search for items. You're a bit bloody late. Right. Hey, why did I come in here again? Oh yeah. Passing notes. Keep the. Uh, oh, iron. Hello. Try and find as much materials as we can. That's all just L fruit, don't need that. Cassandra's clutches. And here I paid that little knife ear to inform me the moment you were free. No matter, no matter. Segret, honored to meet you. Thank you for all you've done. Hopefully, we'll still do. While wearing and your purchase. Yes. I anything.
eyes are a little circumstantial. Sure. Sail. My wares are at the table. Again with the arrows. Why? Elven Cole. Battle Mage Arm. Awesome. I suppose you got a blueprint for that. No. Why? Why would you? Let's see. I will come back to you in a minute because I feel I get better where. There's another shop outside. A blacksmith, no less. Interesting. If I want something, what can you make? Start simple. Something to keep it on the table and we can talk. You'll need materials. You should have what you want just outside. Okay. Modified weapons. Craft armor. Should still be a store around you. Oh, here it is. Tactician's renewal. We will need that later, but not right now. You can use it to get rid of that stupid lightning spell. Because it's going to be the death of me. Modify armor. That's armor I already contain. That's no good. Creating armor? Craft weapons. That'd be handy, but all I have is a stupid sword grip. Another time, then. Apprentice coat. I need a lot of cloth, apparently. <laughs> right, well, looks like we're gonna have to kill some things. Hey! Staff schematic. What's in this box? Apprentice coat arms. Maybe I'm better wait until I get schematics. Yeah. Okay, back to the war room while we're here. It's a lot of backtracking in this game so far. Oh dear. Your kind killed the most holy. Lies. Your kind let her die. Shut your mouth, mate! Enough! Knight Captain! That is little. We are not Templars any longer. We are all part of the Inquisition. And what does that mean exactly? Back already, Chancellor. Haven't you done enough? I'm curious, Commander, as to how your Inquisition and its herald will restore order as you promised. Of course you are. Back to your duties, all of you. 
We could always just kill this guy and save ourselves the bother. Mages and Templars were at war, killing each other for the death. Which is why we require a proper authority to guide them back to order. Who? You? Random clerics who weren't important enough to be at the The rebel inquisition and its so-called Herald of Andraste? I think not. If the proper authority hadn't completely failed, the Conclave wouldn't have been needed. So you suggest I blame the Chantry and exalt a murderer? What of justice? That won't help restore order in the here and now. <laughs> order will never be restored so long as this rebellion is allowed to fester. Don't let anyone riot while we're gone. Walls will be standing when you return, I hope. Right, to the war room. Cullen, get the others. We have a mission to do. And I, shall embrace a and I can't be arse with more plot. Right, for Elden. The Black Emporium. You were saying something about Colin? Hmm? I, uh, yes. Let's go. Elden has limited space for our soldiers to train. Perhaps we could set up something over here. Maybe we can get some blueprints here. Scratcher. Who said that? Was it him? Okay. The schematics of legend. Jesus. That's a little too pricey. Mm, that's not much better. Oh dear. <laughs> Would you consider allowing me to acquire your hand? <laughs> After your death, of course. Oh, this is more like it. Drake stone, dragon lens scales, bronto hide, bluefoot. Just sells me all the common materials. Is this everything that's here?
Okay. So, definitely not the place for me. Okay. Back to Haven, I guess. Loading screens take forever. Boo 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 Need to add more music in this game. That would be nice. Hey, there's more shops up here. No, we're back. Ah, fuck's sake. It's all a lie. Drop a beat. Parkour! Parkour! There we go. Du, 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 du. Out of the way, prick! I wish to summon the minions! Soldiers a safe distance from the temple. Our best guess at safe anyway. We need more power. Very well. Well, you do that, and then by the time episode three is done, we may have something. Liliana, I will send in. To work. Yep. Storm Coast. That'll be good. Address a nobleman's concerns. Black Emporium. Hard Harden High Turn Vadic's Revenge. Um Perfect. Let's see what we have. Ten minutes to kill, eh? Well, I suppose I'll just have to wait. Then again, there isn't very long left of this anyway. So, 
I will take the rest of the time and go and gather materials outside. Mother Giselle. Plus six magic. Ooh, we're taking you. I do need some armor, so I suppose for now, at the very least, we will take you as well. Um, I don't think we need a stupid hat. armor perfect they can't see your face well, now we look fantastic oh wait no that's a lie we look stupid Shaboom! Let's see, we're just gonna have to harvest materials right now. I don't really want to... I don't have much time left to do anything significant in this episode anyway, so... I'm not gonna take the time just to grind a little for materials. one of those that's kind of how the majority of this let's play is going to be. Um, as a, I'm not used to doing a lot of commentary so if there are times where it gets a bit quiet I can only apologise. I kind of tend to stop talking during cutscenes and I don't get up again after it. Because I like to just mellow out when I'm playing games. I don't know about the viewers at home but you know it just it just feels right. I mean, I could talk about this game for days. You know, I mean, for example, look at the detail in it. Look at it. It's gorgeous. Impending death above you, the constant flowing of snow, the fact I'm walking on war like a boss. Fair enough, it's ice, but still. Actually, I wonder if there's anything fancy around here. I feel like there should be hidden loot. As I say, if you feel I could improve the show or make changes to make it slightly better, by all means, post in the comments and let me know. Uh, I will happily do what I can to improve the quality of the videos. I 
I do like this little synchronized fight and scene they have going on there. Alright, well that was a complete waste of time. Oh, enemies. If I gather all these materials, I can make a start when we have some schematics. Right. Acquired some iron. Oh look, we're back on the bridge. Right, how much time remains of this glorious episode? Less than a minute. Well, I think this will be... I should run back to the fast travel point. We can begin our next match from there. Do 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 Running through the trees, summery a breeze in the middle of winter. It's bliss. Now I'm gonna have to change that armor. It looks fucking horrendous. I think that's the only real issue I've got with the mage characters, is the majority of their early tiered armor is horrendous to look at. It just doesn't look nice. To be fair, they do get better weapons and things later on, but at this stage, it's just not good. So if I remember, I need to summon the war room one more time. We will teleport to the area, and then I will make, say my goodbyes. This is more self-reminder to me than use, but hey, gotta keep track. Chancellor Roderick came to speak with me. Could you try not to antagonize him? Alright, well, since this is a good time to do it, I'll end the, t the feed now. So, thank everybody for watching. Uh, hope to see you in the next episode. Uh, leave a comment in the... Well, leave a comment in the comments, I guess, if you think um, I should make the video shorter, perhaps, or add a bit more detail. It's up to you. Um, like, preferably subscribe. You don't have to, but hey, I would appreciate it. And, um, yeah, again, if you watched all the way to the end, thumbs up for you. You're a good, you're a good sport. So, I guess that's it. Thanks again, and see you next time. Bye.